the intention of this project is to support the, the management of materials in New York State that otherwise might be disposed by understanding what's in the garbage, trying to get the valuable materials out of garbage, and to promote better recycling processes. to start on this um, and then I recruited in Dr. Hewitt and Dr. Hur, and then we brought in Dr. Thyberg and the various graduate students and undergraduate students who were working on the project. Uh, we put everything uh, from truck down there and then we uh, set up the tables first. And then we have each basket around the paper recyclables and then each labels for each basket. And then we start sorting. So starting from the big ones like OCC, uh, box board, big ones, books, those you can pick up from the paper recyclables. And then we put the small ones on, to, uh, on the table, and then we're sorting the small ones. Our receipts, printer paper. Glossy paper, glossy. Here we have a bundle of newspapers. And then once we put everything in each category, we weigh each of them, and then make notes of each of them. ground level looking at a very detailed sort of snapshot of um, waste in New York State, but that has a lot of very large implications for policy and for uh, decision making at a higher level. And so that is, I think, where we can really add some, some value, um, both to the state and then to various municipalities throughout the state as well. Getting a more granular look at, at what people do with their trash and, and why, and perhaps how we can then begin to modify some behaviors. We are creating a web-based model to calculate um, cost and savings for recycling. That's following uh, New Year's State law. On the process, we have to take into account transportation, collection source. By making this model, we're kind of guiding these waste managers and and showing them like, hey, there is, there's savings and there's costs and maybe there's a revenue uh, for which they can profit off these recyclables. The model was created using Microsoft Excel and we created three different options. Um, these options are, number one, using your own values to calculate the cost. The option two is using um, preset numbers and option three is using um, a preset number with the breakdown. I work with the team to investigate uh, the impact of China's national SWAT policy, or we call it garbage import ban, and its effect on the state recycling and waste management. We hope to understand how national policy would impact the global sustainability, including the impact to New York State and Long Island local businesses. We're working on the effects of national food policy uh, in the United States, but mostly it was concerned about the Brookhaven Material Recovery Facility, all about the history, development of curb sites, then how was the uh, dual stream working, single stream working, how was few programs like pay as you throw automated collections and different contamination issues. It's not only because of the environmental problem that they are implementing these policies. It has 
highly political uh, motivation. It's very, very uh, profit driven. Before all these policies were implemented, the market is highly liquid. People was making a lot of money out of this industry. And then uh, after this policy implemented, everything price went down. The education part is very important. Education to, to public. People everywhere don't know how to recycle things properly or where to put the waste in which bin. It would really help to understand what's in the garbage, what exactly people are throwing out, how that changes over time, and how it changes from place to place.